while most debates focus more on global warming and climate changes, natural disasters are also becoming more prominent and more serious. In fact, just last year alone, natural disasters led to over 8,000 accounted deaths and affected over 500 million people worldwide through the loss of jobs, housing, and other essential needs. In addition, globally, they caused damages amounting to over 100 billion US dollars. Victims of natural disasters need our help, and fortunately, there are many ways for us to contribute. You can always help by donating foods, supplies, or money through charity and fundraising. However, keep in mind that food items can spoil in transit, so it is important that they are properly stored, not expired, and non-perishable. For example, canned foods. If you are short on money or food but still want to help, don't worry. You can still help by donating blood. Many people are injured in natural disasters and may desperately need blood transfusions to survive. There are processes that health officials go through to make sure that your blood is safe for people who need it. Your blood will be screened for any drugs or diseases and qualified blood will be labeled to prevent the transfusion of incompatible blood. If the site of the natural disaster is nearby, you can literally go the extra mile by volunteering in a relief team. These teams can help people through emotional support or by distributing finances and supplies. When distributing supplies, it is important that they are sanitary to prevent any potential illnesses. The relief teams can also help by clearing rubble and reusing those materials to make new and sustainable shelters. It is important to replace the lumber that may be used for reconstruction because a loss in plant life can cause many undesirable and unpredictable consequences, such as erosion and an increased rate in global warming. One last way to help is to offer a house as a temporary shelter for people affected by the natural disasters until their area is rebuilt. Temporary shelters should be safe, clean, and stocked up on food and water. The hurricane season is coming up in a few months. So let us take action to help people in need of support and prepare for approaching calamities to ensure that our future will continue to be bright and full of possibilities.